Hello, welcome. As it is, we're going to continue. Right now, I got forty-seven dollars. We come to face Brawley again. I saw Silla face me chop. Raising her defense. Send out Blight. This time I use Dragon Rage to take down Machop. Light takes down a chop. Go against Metadite. And that's huge. Metadite loses focus and can't move. But his metal claw was huge. He has Marco Huda and you just buck up. This is the different online season if if you're hearing it. Oh, 
Super effective, but Marco Huto is able to withstand it. And there's reversal. It's not very effective, but it did mad damage. He uses the super potion. Critical confusion right there. Super effective. And he's confused. I have Scylla Harden. Hopefully he'll be too confused. And he is. He harms himself. I'll try to make him go for poison sting for affliction. No luck. It hurt itself in confusion. And we could have finished this. Oh, wait. Snaps out of confusion. Brawly doesn't use a potion. It's not very effective, but Silo goes down. Send out shit. Nerves reversal. It's not very effective, but it takes down her. It's not very effective. Mad damage, though. And there's confusion. Down, Marco Huda goes. Silly gains all experience. Grows level secretly. HP defensive. All rows intermediate. Speed raises the highest. Whoa, wow, you made me much a much better splash than I expected. You swamped me. Okay, you got me. Take this gym badge. Gives me a hundred and ninety dollars. That's good enough to get back on my feet. In this universe. The knuckle badge makes all Pokemon up to level 30. Even those you get in trades obey without question. And you'll be able to use the HM move flash outside of battle. If you like, use this techno machine too. TM08 contains bulk up. It's a move that raises both attack and defense stats. And I register him into the Poke Nav. I feel like I need to go visit Roxanne to do the same thing. I keep thinking about it, but I'm not interested. I normally like to fully train my Pokemon. I only trust daycare people. Mostly. I haven't got a chance to trust anybody else. Alright, as it is, it's nighttime. 
I let Mr. Brenning know that I'm going in the cave and I'll be back for us to set sail again. And the cave is illuminated now. I'm going to catch a whole bunch of Pokemon. Found an escape rope. And finally we make an encounter and it's a Mawal. No silo use Harden. Confusion's not their effective, astonishing hers. Try a poison sting, it doesn't affect my well. I let Silo know though. She does astonish. Send out blight. Critical astonish again. As uh, she uses astonish twice. Uh, blight use dragon rage. And I just feel like this cave is just bad news. I send out blight. It's granite cave. Save live comes out. Uh, Blight used Rage and it doesn't affect And Blight now knows Plus the others Blight grows level secretly HP Blight is trying to learn Scary Face. I do not want him to learn that. I found an Everstone. Right now, we are not being bothered. Makahuda appears. These have been some appearances. Uh, Blight use rage.
White uses Metal Claw too. Shed grows to level 10. Defense. As I call out another level for another game. My name is Steven. I'm interested in rare stones, so I travel here and there. Oh, a letter for me? I hand over the letter to him. Okay, thank you. You went all through this trouble to deliver that? I need to thank you. Let me see, I'll give you this TM. It contains my favorite move, Still Wing. And I already know this. I'm putting away the TM-47 in the HMTM's pocket. Oh, there's an EXP share in this letter. It says here that it's a gift for you from my father. Yeah, and I get another EXP share. Awesome. The Pokemon holding that EXP share will be given some of the EXP points from battle. It will get experience points even if it didn't actually battle. Steven, a Pokemon appear quite capable. If you keep training, you can even become a champion of the Pokemon League one day. That's what I think. I don't know. Since we got to know each other, let's register one of our Pokemon. Rather start Steven and the picking ad. Now I've got to hurry along. And there's Upper Cave Hillside. And I see down below where I was at a certain floor. Blight uses Dragon Rage again. <laughs> Maka Huda repairs. So now Blight. There's Ember. I try and I attempt some night fishing. Magic Harp appears. And it's a female.
I'll throw my Pokeball. And I'd catch it. Blight and Shed still gain experience from the ordeal. Swimming muscles are weak, so it's easily washed away by currents. In places where water pools, you can see many Magikarp depositing it by the flow. Her name is Tage. Give experience share to Tage. And I take turns holding both of them, her and Shed. If you and me team up as a combo, we'll be invincible when it comes to all things. Small game. Spot on, my friend. We shall be the small game duo. Isn't that a ripe image? Haha. Uh -huh. uh, okay. It's the same thing. I collect official small game. Licensed merchandise. I have a small game dolls official. Official small game brand clothing. And official license small game picture books. Hee <laughs> hee, I own. I'm not sharing anything with you. Oh, what a bad kid. Wow, you bothered to cross the sea to travel and visit Dofer. Did you maybe come here to visit us because you heard about Brawly? He's so cool. Everyone analyzes him. Gorge your eyes on this. It's a silk scarf, isn't it? It's right at the cutting edge of fashion. Yeah. Oh. You can see your eyes twinkling. You appreciate my dazzling style. Oh. You are a delight. Here you go. Want to have it? Yes, I do. And as it is... Oops. I end up giving it to Scylla to hold. All right, everybody, like, comment, subscribe, playlist, add, as we are going to be on the next section where we will be talking to Mr. Brittany and traveling to the next area of Slateport, as I believe.